Yo, what is up YouTube? My name's Aaron and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to get the game Call of Duty Black Ops for free. That's right, free. Now, here recently, and I don't want to see too much because it's going to be my video for tomorrow, but basically Treyarch released something very big and something else that's going to be an addition to the 360 version of Black Ops 3. And if you've already guessed it, yes, Black Ops will come free with the 360 version of Black Ops 3. So, if you want to get the game for free, if you don't already have it and you know that you're going to get Black Ops 3, that's how you're getting the game for free. I think it's amazing, but uh, wait to hear. I mean, there are some drawbacks to that, and that video will be coming out tomorrow, so make sure you stay tuned for that. So, I, I want to finish this video with one other thing, and just... I'm going to start promoting this, I don't know why, there's no point as of right now, but if you guys are in the market for a next generation console, I would strongly suggest that you go towards the Xbox One Elite version. Now that comes with a solid state hybrid, one terabyte hard drive, and the brand new Elite controller. I think it's a great deal, it's the same price as any other one terabyte console, and you're getting their $150 premium controller and a solid state hybrid drive now i don't know if i'm gonna update to this or buy that drive and install it myself i don't know how that works but that drive is 100 worth it it's probably gonna cut your download times and speaking of download black ops the free version of black ops that you will receive is downloadable only so i know you can't really download a 360 version of the game onto your xbox one but if you're gonna get an Xbox One, you have to install Black Ops 3, and from what I hear, it's gonna be a huge, huge install. I'm thinking around 75 gigabytes, if not closer to 90. So make sure you guys have plenty of room on your console, and if you have the Elite console, it's going to go by so quick compared to, I would say probably a solid 30 to 40 minutes, if not one hour, depending on how big the game is, but if you have that nice new solid state hybrid, just be expecting around a 20 to 30 minute window to install and be able to play the game. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, I can't wait to see you tomorrow, I hope you guys subscribe if you haven't already, like this video, likes help a ton, and comment, I want to get some good, some good you know ideas flowing in the comment section, tell me what you think about this video, tell me what you think about the channel, what do you want to see next? I'm out.